Hi and welcome to our channel The Travel Boss. Today's video is about the top 10 things to do in Tirana, Albania. The capital of Albania used to be at the top of most lists of the worst cities in Europe. Tirana was run by Stalinists for decades and during that time the city became grey and grim with few buildings and services. Today, Tirana is a very nice little city that is the cultural, entertainment and political center of Albania. It is still often very chaotic, but it is also a very nice place to live. Here are the top things we think you should do in Tirana, Albania. Before we count from 10 to 1, please subscribe to our channel The Travel Boss and also tell us what is your favorite thing to do in Tirana in the comments. Number 10. Climb to the top of the clock tower. Together with the Etem Bay Mosque, the clock tower is a unique piece of architecture that represents the city of Tirana. The same person who built the Etem Bay Mosque also built the clock tower. It is a piece of culture that has been there since 1822 and shows the time in Tirana. By going up the steps and getting to the top of the tower, you can get a great view of Tirana's main square and the area around it. Number 9. Take a history lesson in Skanderbeg Square. Skanderbeg Square, named after the national hero who helped Albania break away from the Ottoman Empire for a short time in the 1500s, is definitely something to do in Tirana. In the middle of the square is a big bronze statue of Skanderbeg on horseback, which looks like a cross between Alexander the Great and Thor. Number 8. Take a day trip to the seaside. One of the best things to do outside of Tirana is to go to the Adriatic Sea and see the old city of Dursi. These days, most of the cheap hotels and restaurants along the seafront are mostly used by tourists from Kosovo. Even though things aren't perfect, Dursi is lively, cheap, and easy to get to. Number 7. Visit a not-so-ancient pyramid. The concrete pyramid of Tirana, called Pyramida, is just a short walk away from Skanderbeg Square. It was built by the daughter of Albania's dictator Enver Hoxha in 1987 as a memorial to her father. From 1944 to 1985, Enver Hoxha ruled Albania with an iron fist. Today the building is broken down, missing its tiles, and covered in graffiti. People have talked about tearing it down, but others say it should stay standing as a reminder of how bad Stalinism was. Number 6. Observe Albania's elite at play. Enver Hoxha lived in a place called The Block, which was once off limits to everyone except the Communist Party's inner circle. Now, it's where all the beautiful people in Tirana gather. There are expensive hotels, designer coffee shops, restaurants, and shops in the world today. Take in the modern glitz from Sky Club, a bar high up in the air that spins and gives you a 360-degree view of the city. Number 5. Immerse yourself in the nightlife. Tirana's nightlife gets better every year, and the clubs, which are mostly in the Boloku area, have a lot of different themes and vibes. You should go with a local who knows which ones to go to and which to avoid. But keep in mind that Albania is still a very traditional country. Number 4. Relax in Park Uai Mav. Grand Park. Many people in Tirana go to this big wooded park to relax, whether they want to fish in the man-made lake, have a picnic on the grass, or hang out in one of the many cafe bars. Considering how bad the traffic can get in Tirana, this park lets the city's Mediterranean feel shine through. Number 3. Visit Mount Daiti National Park. If you want to know what to do outside of the city center in Tirana, go to Mount Daiti National Park. It's a popular place for locals to get some fresh air and walk through the countryside. You can take an expensive cable car made in Austria or a cheap city bus to get there. If you want to stay the night, there are hotels, guest houses, and restaurants there. Number 2. Pay tribute to history in the House of Leaves Museum. The House of Leaves is one of the most unusual museums in Albania. It looks a lot like the Stasi headquarters in what used to be East Germany. You should put this on your list of things to do when you're in Tirana. Once you're inside the infamous National Intelligence Service headquarters, also called the House of Spies, you might not be able to say a word. 
Inside the House of Leaves, you will learn about how horrible the dictatorial regime in Albania was, as well as the stories of the people who were hurt by the regime, but still spoke out against it. Number 1. Enjoy the view of the Ethem Bay Mosque. The Ethem Bay Mosque is one of the few mosques that did not get destroyed by the communists. By the end of 1967, all religious buildings had been shut down, demolished, or turned into warehouses or schools. Even though the communist government tried to stop them, about 10,000 people went into the mosque on January 18, 1991. This was a big step toward bringing back religious freedom and bringing down communism in the country. Today, people can enjoy the mosque's beautiful design and the fine wall and ceiling paintings that follow the traditions of the Middle East. The frescoes in the mosque show trees, waterfalls, bridges, and still lifes, which aren't often seen in Islamic art. So these are the top 10 best things to do in Tirana. Do you agree with our list and think that enjoying the view of the Ethem Bay Mosque is the best thing to do in Tirana? Share your views in the comments section below and don't forget to subscribe to our channel The Travel Boss. Thanks for watching.